Here's a quick walk around of my Alice Chalmers C tractor. Pretty straightforward. The intake and exhaust manifold is all one. Here's your carburetor and your generator voltage regulator. The fuel tank is up here. Here is the fuel petcock on and off. This is the air filter. Radiator up front. Obviously the exhaust stack. That black right there is the breather for the engine. And this is the intake. Temperature gauge for the radiator, radiator cap. Steering linkage. Left side is the clutch. Gear shifter, you have three forward gears and one reverse gear. The 12 volt battery is located underneath this box. Has an amp meter. The key, this here is for the headlights, on and off. It has parking brakes. The brakes are on the right side. And when you push down the brake, in order for the parking brake to work, as you push down on the brake, flip that over, and now you have a parking brake. That lever there is for the rear PTO, which is blind on the back, and a belt pulley on the back as well. Here is the starter, oil pressure gauge, oil filter, 12 volt ignition, Delco Remy distributor. The governor is up front. Another shot of the radiator. And it's an overhead valve. The starter is, uh, the start is all mechanical. You basically push this lever right here with your foot. When you push it in, it pushes that button. And as that push and button gets pushed in, it actually starts the uh, starter, very straightforward. Lastly, up on the steering box is a throttle and a choke. Now I already ran this to drive it where it is, but I'll go ahead and start it now. Step one is make sure it's out of gear. And if you're sitting on it, it's a good habit to push down the clutch. Since I'm not sitting on it, this actually has a neat lever that you flip over. There. Now the clutch is pushed in. That's just nice. So, uh, you know, if you, for some reason it is in gear, you know, you don't start it uh, in gear because there are no safeties when it comes to doing that. Okay, I won't choke it. So the choke is in. That's choke. That's no choke. Like I said, this is throttle. It's high throttle and low. We're gonna start it right here. It's out of gear. And I'm just going to push the starter button, which is typically operated with your right foot. I'm gonna start it by pushing it. And then once it's started, I'll dial back the throttle to get it to a nice idle. So step one is turn the ignition on. And we're out of gear. I'll go ahead and start it. Nice low idle. Alright, if you have any questions about it, let me know. And thanks for watching.